Uh, thank you all for being here. We are um, we are here at Fairfield's Town Green as we just finished celebrating our 376th birthday. And and being a big history buff, it, it just reminds us that you know this country was founded on the principles of participation and and people who have a say in their government. So as part of that. Uh, we have convened this meeting to, to share with the public and renew our call for a special session uh, as it relates to the business climate that we are experiencing in the state of Connecticut. And I want to reiterate, the climate it itself is not for anyone to be blamed. We are in a difficult cycle of business, but understanding that, we have a responsibility as legislators to lead and not simply put our head in the stand and say we will wait for session in January. The crisis is at hand and that we are calling for a special session to get back to work, to get back to work to address the issues that are facing and confronting all of our people, businesses, hospitals, those people that are in need of disability services. We are all impacted every single day we are at a crisis in confidence and a crisis in where our state is going. I, I, I want to sum up this discussion by going back to, to saying that, as I mentioned a little bit of the history of the greatness of this country, the greatness of this country is the fact that elected leaders reflected the will of the people. And we're hoping through this conversation, through this dialogue, that we give the power back to the people that you write to your legislators, you write to your elected leaders, and that you demand a special session. You demand to call us back into working for you because the plan at current doesn't work. Ask the hospitals that have to lay off staff and, and, and not be able to provide critical care. Ask the mother and the father who has a child in need for disability services that has to wait on a list. You have individuals suffering from addiction and mental health services that are not getting their services. Let us ask our elected leaders, speak out, restore the power back to the people, and let's get back to work. Truly, let's get back to work and restore the greatness of Connecticut. So I'm thrilled that you're all here, but more importantly, we're also here to answer any questions you may have.